today's video, I'm going to show you how to add and customize alerts in Streamlabs for your streams. So let's get into the video. So open Streamlabs, go to sources and add a source. Under here, you will see alert box, add it. Once you're in this little area, just make sure that all of these are ticked or you can untick the ones you don't want to show up. When you finish that, click close and your alert box should be added. So once you're tested, it should come up like this. So to customize your alerts, you need to go down to the side until you see dashboard and click it. Once you do that, you should be brought in to Streamlabs website. And on the corner here, you should go down until you see alert box. Right now, this is it. You can customize everything got to do with your alert boxes from this menu. Your delays, where the text appears, everything can be found right here. To add custom images, you need to go along this little area right here, like donations, and click it. Once you're here, scroll down until you see image and click this little one right here, and it will bring you in to image gallery but you can upload your own ones after that you can then customize the sound volume the duration the font size everything even the message that is displayed so to go and find custom alerts you can actually go and use streamlabs itself they have an alert library there's a few of them that are free but a lot of them you need prime for but you don't need to buy prime all you need to do is go to the search bar and type in free and they will show you all the free ones the best thing about using streamlabs is when you click install they will take care of everything you just need to click the install button and nothing else or you can go on to Google and search for free alerts for streaming. Some of them you'll actually have to buy online as well, but there's a few free ones and you just need to add them onto the Streamlabs site manually and then fix everything about it. Guys, that is how you add and customize alerts using Streamlabs OBS.